My name is Dean Chopez. My company is Culturing Solutions. We are a manufacturer of photobioreactors, which are a closed looped, enclosed, fully automated system for the mass cultivation of a monoculture algae. It uses a platform to hold the tubes that's very robust in strength. It can handle up to a 130 mile per hour wind load. The tubes are designed to optimize the absorption of photons from either the sun, natural light, or we can utilize artificial lights in the form of LEDs. Uh, our type two photobioreactor combines the best of both worlds. Uh, traditional open ponds is the way algae was grown in the past. And through different studies, including the aquatic species program, they found that contamination is a serious issue. So we've designed a system to prohibit contamination of invasive species of algae as well as bacteria that can crash the system. The capital expense for such a system in the past has been cost prohibitive to make something like this a reality. So we've reduced the capex to such a point where it's now cost effective to grow algae to make biofuels. Algae is used for everything from nutraceuticals, which are nutritional products, vitamins, health food items, uh, pharmaceuticals, and into biofuels. Algae hold what we believe to be the key to making biofuels a reality and to displace petroleum as a fuel source for liquid transportation fuels. Algae provide a twofold benefit. One is that we can mitigate or offset carbon from CO2 emitters such as power plants, uh, concrete manufacturers, and any type of industrial process that creates CO2. We can mitigate that CO2, take that CO2, grow algae, and then displace petroleum products with that algae. So it's a two-fold benefit. We believe that algae for biofuels is a reality, but we also believe that you must implement other industries such as nutraceuticals and higher value products combined with the value chain of biofuels to make it a reality, to make it cost effective and a profitable situation. At the World Congress, we've, we've learned quite a bit of other companies that have supporting technologies that can increase our production rates as well as help us with processing the algae as well.